Ladies and gentlemen, this is Fred Allen. I'd like to ask you a simple question. Why is it when you folks come into a theater like this to see a picture, before you can see the picture, you have to sit there and look at a list of names for 20 minutes? Now, for example, in this picture, the first name you see is... Who needs Jack Benny, a little radio actor, in a picture like this, when we have Don Amici, an outstanding personality, William Bendix, a three-fisted he-man, Victor Moore, Grandma's glamour boy, and Rudy Valley, fresh from Yale. On top of Benny, you have to look at a long list of names like this. Who knows who these people are? Who cares? You can find names like these in any phone book. Screen treatment and screenplay. These four people are now out of work. You'll see why in just a minute. Riskin's contribution. In one scene, the family is eating dinner. Riskin loaned us a half a pound of butter so the bread would look yellow in the close-ups. Look at that top name, associate producer. He's the only man in Hollywood who would associate with the producer. Get a load of this mob. They're all relatives of the producer. In Hollywood, all a producer produces is relatives. Here's Mr. Skirball's name again. He's in twice, you see. Well, it's his picture. This is Mr. Skirball's father-in-law, another relative. That's what I mean. Why should you folks have to sit out there and look at all these names? You know, someday I'm going to get my own relatives and produce my own picture. And my picture will start with the story, like this. One night last November, an eccentric millionaire sat in his den making out a new will. <laughs> 